The two returned to the shelters. Sora hid behind a window and secretly glanced at them. Raven remembered something and gave Sora a small package. Almost forgot about this. Take it and share it with the others. I mean, those sound good, but you could have brought something more nutritious. I didn't make this. It's candied rice crisps I've brought from Shenzu. We call them Rice crispy Treats, but... Oh, thank you, Sensei. The little girl disappeared with the bag of dessert. Give me a moment to triangulate the Hersher's location. Before I forget, I still owe you one. Raven entered a dilapidated shed and emerged with a prisoner tied up with plenty of rope. Oh my god. Tesla? I ran into her before I found you and Sora. There was some misunderstanding. She started it. Why did you? I Okay, this is pretty believable. Let's be honest, it's pretty believable. I only wanted to restrain her, but her language was unhealthy for the children. Gagging her was the only option. Take care of her and meet me at the wall. Remember, I promised Sora to take you alone. And be prepared. The dragon won't make it easy for us. I sensed something strange while fighting it. It felt like human sorrow, pain, and guilt. Instinct drives Honkai beasts to gather around Hershers, but this one wants to protect her. I didn't expect Honkai beasts to have such feelings. It reminds me a lot of you. I felt something in my mind when I fought this Benaris. It felt strange, yet oddly familiar. Do your best, Miss Raiden, but I doubt you could change anything. Well, we'll see about that. I like how there's she's throwing so much doubt May's way and May's gonna go Super Saiyan. May carried Tesla back to the Helios. When the scientist woke, May told her about her meeting with Raven. She doesn't seem surprised. Are you sure you want to find Kiana with her help? She intends to kill her. I must be there to stop her. This is getting out of hand. We need to call for support. Yeah, like, why not? Why not call for support? What's the problem? That woman is dangerous. I know, but her hatred for Kiana seems personal and not part of the Serpent's plans. Why does it sound like May's getting further away? She'll kill Kiana for certain, and she'll show no mercy to anyone in her way. But despite all of this, I need her help to find my friend. There were so many times when she was right there before me.
The Battle of Shixel, the fight against Rita, and when Durandal took her. I could only watch on hopelessly as she was rested away, too weak to even do anything. It wasn't your fault. Thank you, Dr. Tesla. You have always comforted me. Oh no, May, what are you thinking? But I can't go on like this. Not anymore. I can't keep lying to myself. Kiana's presence helped me forget about the painful past, the loneliness, and the confusion. But when she was gone, I suddenly realized that nothing's changed at all. I... I haven't changed at all. I'm still just a timid girl cowering in my corner, and I failed to notice that everyone was gone until it was too late. My inability to change led to our separation. It has led to what we're facing today. She has always protected me, but I failed to do anything for her. I hate myself. I can't go on like this. I hate myself. I can't go on like this. I must accept the fact that I lack the powers to protect her. Accepting this doesn't mean that I'm giving up. No. It will make me see things more clearly. Oh no, May. She's gonna borrow some power, y'all already know. I have to make sacrifices to bring her home. Oh, I have the chills. I'll face anything. I don't care if I'm walking directly into a trap or a setup against a deadly enemy. Because I know this is the only way I can protect Kiana. Just be safe, May. Oh, shit, man. The silence of the crow. Here we go. Let's go. Next stage. Next stage. Next stage. Raven waited quietly under the Nagazora wall. The air was still. A familiar yet hateful scent kept seeping through from the opposite side of the wall. The source of this scent had not moved for a while. The girl was probably unconscious. Raven knew she must be extremely careful. Any mistake could spell her doom. She clenched her fists. Her hunt for the demoness was nearing its end. Long had she waited for this moment. But, what happened three nights ago continued to sow the seeds of doubt in her mind. Raven fought her under the brilliant neon lights of Ark City and tasted defeat. Raven waited for the enemy to pull the trigger and end her life, but she saw hesitance in her blue eyes. The Hersher of the Void spared her life that night. The Hersher of the Void saved Ark City that night. When dawn broke, she witnessed the girl falling lifelessly from the heavens. Was she dead? She had always prayed for that moment, but it brought her no satisfaction. That bottomless hole remained in her heart. There was no comfort. Approaching footsteps ended her thoughts about the past. You're here. She's near the second quarantine gate. She's near the second quarantine gate of the wall. I hope you're ready. Let's go. All right. Oh, we got an elevator. Oh, this is looking a little tense up here. This looks like a boss fight. The path is clear. 
The wind blows. A thunderstorm suddenly descended. Raven's cape fluttered loudly as a giant beast soared into the sky. It's time to face that beast. Oh shit. My head, it's hurting again. Oh no. The Honkai Queen's awakening in there. Little does Raven know. I've been trying to tell you, Raven. Y'all, sh you shouldn't have kept doubting Mei. It's the end. Not yet. We have to take it down before it takes us down. What's happening? What's happening? Uh oh. Oh. Oh, it's charging. Go, Raven. Destroy. Come on, come on. We got to do it. Destroy. We got it. We hit it down into the water? It ain't over yet. Oh shit, are we about to fight each other? We're close to the Hersher. She's dangerous and may lose control any time. Things will only get worse if you send her away. I'm actually curious about your choice. I'm taking her away. I'm afraid you will only walk away with her corpse. Because I will kill her. And I won't let that happen. She drew her blade. Raven smiled as though she had been expecting this. Ah, oh, the feels, dude. Oh, man, I'm ready. She drew her blade. Raven smiled as though she had been expecting this. <laughs> Very well. Here we go, y'all. We both know this is the only way to settle our disagreement. Hit me with that good music. But Raven, I'm sorry, but you're done. I will save Kiana. It's not even a question. You think just because you can disappear? Oh shit, she's doing her she's doing some special shit. Not special enough. Chop, chop. Oh, wait. Let me dodge. Oh! Oh, shit. There's the thumbnail for the video. You said you won't let that happen. But the serpent knows everything about you. Without the gem of conquest, you're just an ordinary girl. You've always failed to protect her. This fight won't be any different. Why are you doing this? Why should she deserve such injustice? Is it because of what she is? What she's done in the past? It's only because she's a Hersher, isn't it? But she would never hurt anyone. How can this... Oh, she's getting pissed. How can this world treat this kind and gentle girl with such cruelty? Honkai energy levels are rising. This... This will kill you as well. 
I'll gladly trade my life for hers. She saved my life and I shall save hers in return. Here it comes. Oh, shit. Oh, you're fucked, Raven. Raven doesn't flinch. Raven's just like, okay, I knew you were going to do that shit. The electrical crackling subsided. May's eyes reverted to their normal hues as she slowly regained her footing. Raven felt her scorched solium talons. They were no longer fit for combat. Oh, shit. May just destroyed them. That power. It was real. That strong look in your eyes. I like it. Take her. Leave. Get as far away from here as you can. Keep your promise. Do not let her hurt anyone. You have yourself to thank, girl. You proved yourself at the very last moment. Now go, quickly, before I change my mind. Honestly, May could kill your ass, but... Raven disappeared in a gust of wind. Her voice echoed in the breeze. Raiden May. Ride in May, we shall meet again. You know where to find me. Holy shit. We're really here, guys. We're really actually here. We actually found Kiana. I'm honestly like, what is about to happen? Every time these two are reunited, it's like a chemical reaction. And shit just starts blowing up. Oh, here we go. Helios, a few moments later, May nervously stood before the door. She spent four difficult months and finally saved Kiana from both Shixel and the World Serpent. May never stopped dreaming of this reunion for many months, yet she felt no joy when it did happen. Fear and apprehension filled her heart. Kiana. Kiana. She was exhausted, but she dared not sleep, for her dreams were filled with images of Kiana's pain. Kiana was still healthy just two days ago, but she was now unconscious and covered in Honkai infection patterns. May refused to believe that Kiana's reassuring smiles were mere disguises for unbearable pain. She tried to ignore what Raven told her and prayed that the surgeons would prove the serpent wrong. The door opened. Dr. Tesla, how is she? Emergency treatment worked. She is no longer critical and should wake up soon enough. But she isn't getting better. The bloody Hersher kept trying to activate the core and spread the infection. Kiana did her best and fought off Siren for months, but her body will eventually fall apart. Absorbing a massive amount of Honkai energy to save a city from destruction certainly didn't help. Tesla's voice grew faint and soon became barely intelligible mumbling. I've sent a level 1 distress call to HQ. The Hyperion is heading over here at full speed. May, I want you to listen to me carefully. Two months. She has less than two months left. That's the amount of time we have. Hello? It's me. 
What is your status? I'm doing well. Honkai levels in Nagazora are approaching the eruption threshold. Testing may proceed as scheduled. <laughs> What's so funny? You're doing well? I beg to differ. I know all about that little side project of yours. <laughs> hmm. So you found out. Natasha. Natasha, yo. I've, I've told you many times, Natasha. Our sire decides what happens to K423. We may not act on our own. I'm disappointed that you did just that. You should know that you're not getting away with this. We'll see about that. What do you mean? Kiana Kazlana is worthless to the serpent if she remains a partial hersher. It's a problem you can't fix. But I've found something. I found the power that the World Serpent really needs. The power that will complete the Hersher's metamorphosis. Does she know its emotions? Does she know its emotions? Oh shit. Here it is, guys. Thunders over Nagazora, chapter 17. Oh boy, I cannot wait. I cannot wait. All right, guys. Well, that's it for chapter 16. It was awesome. It was a ton of lore building up with May. Really brought back May's story to kind of the forefront of everything. I can't wait to see what happens. I'm pretty sure it's going to be really sad. I know you guys always tell me this game is all depressing. I have a feeling I know what's going to happen, but I can't wait to see the cutscene. So thank you guys so much for watching. I really do appreciate it. Next video should be out on Thursday, and I hope everybody is having a great week. But anyway, guys, I'll see you in the next one.